Yo guys, what are you saying? It's your boy Jack Weller here. I'm gonna fly some planes. I'm gonna go uh, to Poland or something. It's gonna be sick. I'm gonna be flying. Um, I've never flown Buzz before, but then I heard that call sign was like Magic Sun or something. That's sick. Like, why would I not want to fly like on an airline with the call sign Magic Sun? It sounds sick. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. That is what we're doing today, my friends. I'm gonna listen to some bangers on the way as well gonna be great i haven't actually planned a flight or anything like that yet so we might as well do that quickly open up the sim actually no i don't want to do that yet oh fuck it we don't need gatwick scenery who needs it let's open up the sim let's go here um we're not even flying from gatwick anyway i don't think cool so um let's have a look on the map see where we want to fly i was going to fly to poland uh, Warszawa's online. Katowice has got tower, actually. Okay, we could fly from Katowice to Stancid isn't controlled, but... Yeah, let's... Since Katowice has got control, it really does, let's... Let's go Katowice to Stancid. Sounds pretty good, I think. Let's do that. Um, I'll put this one here so you can actually see it. If I open up Simbrief... Shh, don't tell anyone about the Simplaza there. That was a coincidence, mate. Just open up a whole sim brief. I think I'm streaming. I, th I hope. Yeah, I am. Sick. That's what you want to see. That game is very loud. Okay. Let's go. Dispatch system. It's going to be a really fun stream, by the way, guys. I hope you realise that. Like, don't be... Don't be bored. It's not allowed. On the Jack Weller stream. I know flying a plane for two hours might be boring to some. Get out, we don't want you here. Alright. Actually, I kind of do. I need the viewers. Still. Create a new flight. We are Magic Sun. I love that. I think it's RYS. Flight number. Could get the real one because this is a, a real flight that operates, but I can't be bothered with that. Let's go. Seven nine two three. Seven nine two three. I like that. We're gonna go from Echo Papa Kilo Tango Katowice to Echo Golf Sierra Sierra Stansted. That's a bit of a strange alternate. Whatever we'll go no, I'm not having that actually, that's too far away. Let's go Gawick. Ah, let's just keep it all I don't care. Um we're going in the 737-700 today, the uh, PMTG one. I got some new cockpit textures and they're really nice. Like, I can't wait to see them. I say they're nice, I haven't used them yet, but I can't wait. They look good. 737-700. Where are you? Am I just blind? Ah. Yeah, hello. Guys, it's been a long day, don't judge me. No, it ain't here with the rest of the 737s. Seven, I think I'm losing it. Honestly. 7747, seven, seven, 73... Seven, oh, there it is. 737-700. Why it took me that long to find it, I don't know. Don't judge me. Okay. <laughs> Magic Sun 7923. I cannot believe that's the cool sign. At least I think it is. Like, I can't find anything that says anything on the contrary. I mean, I might make a tip myself. Like, on ATC, but... Look. Um, Renault, Malta, whatever. Why does it say it? Is Katowice even a thing on here? Yeah, Katowice. Cool, cool. Goes to Vatsov. We like Vatsov. Let's see. Buzz. Right now, bought from KLM, really. That's interesting. Yeah, so I'm trying to find the call sign. Pretty sure it's Magic Sun. Yeah, call sign, Magic Sun. <laughs> like, that's jokes. Um, oh. Oh, whatever, my B-Rate's fine, who cares? Who cares? 
Ah, who's putting stuff in the uh, in the chat? Oh, Sony Alfie, don't like him. That's my brother, by the way. We don't want him on the stream. Is it right, Fun Sponge? Is it right? He doesn't even. He don't like DMB. So, like, honestly. Right here we are. Echo Popper, Kilo Tango to Echo Golf Sierra Sierra. That's what we want. Well, thanks, Alf. Thanks for the support. Um, the num to Mike departure. Oh my God, I can't pronounce these. <laughs> okay, that looks fine, I guess. Let's have a quick look at the plan. It looks pretty easy coming out of Cavitz. Uh, and coming into stance, it looks all right. Why is our alternate so far away? I'm gonna set that to. I've changed my mind. I'm gonna set that to um, Echo Golf Kilo Kilo. It just makes more sense in my opinion. Look at us when we come down round. Like I have I don't think that would ever happen. Um, Cruise Index. I think Ryan A uses six. I've no reason to believe Buzz. Be the same. Okay, cool. All looks good to me. Generate flight. Yes. I'm hoping the music ain't too loud. We'll see. We will see. We are got our flight plan all made up. We like to see some um, pre-file on Vatsim. Seven hundred two three. I'm going to write that down before I forget. Of course, like any professional. I have a pen and paper with me, so I can write down my clearances and what have you. So that's pretty sick. We are Ryan. No, not Ryan here. What is it? Okay, in Magic Sun. Magic Sun 7923. Okay. So nothing else to write down. Yeah, I don't think. That's cool. Okay, let's just wait for the game to load. It's going to take a little while. I don't think I actually filed this, did I? No, I didn't. File. Sick. There we are. Let's open up vPilot. Somewhere. There it is. Okay. I apparently it's a two hour flight. Sounds about right. Cool. We've got our vPilot open here. Put that back there. Yeah, all looks good. Don't really know what else to say while the game's loading, but it's alright. I'm going to open it up on my laptop. Uh, sim brief. I'll open up my charts and everything on here as well. Uh, dispatch my flight plan. Yeah. Print view PDF. Sick. Yeah, so obviously I have like my laptop and everything on me. Okay, how about I don't do that? That's a bit scary. I need a way to like get my chat up, but it doesn't really seem to work. Docs chat. So I'm using Restream to stream on Twitch and YouTube at the same time, but it just doesn't, doesn't seem to work. Also, there's got to be a way to have the chat like pinned to the screen. I've opened the stream on my laptop actually. That way I can see it all on there. Look at that, I'm top of my recommendations. Let's mute that. Oh, yeah, hit me up with a like. Hit me up with a like on YouTube, I need it. A like. Would like to hear. Say again. My YouTube channel is Jack Weller. It's a pretty sick channel, you know. What a title that is as well. Listening to some bangers and flying the post. That's cool. I'm gonna put that in the old Discord as well. Everyone needs to see this. Everybody needs to see this. More video. 
I mean, you just see how prepared I am and everything like that. How funny I am. How just I'm the whole package. You know what I mean? We are just casually at everyone in this called of 50 people in it. I'm not a dickhead, I promise. It's just, I know they... Oh, sick, it actually says live on Twitch on there. That's cool. Why are you so small? So... Just ask why am I so small? What does that mean? Does it mean my webcam is not too small, is it? Or is that alright? Would it look better, bigger? I'm gonna ask that. Let's see what he says. I think it looks fine. I think any bigger would just get in the way, wouldn't it? Who's that? It's flying time. You're right, ye old T boy. Ye old T boy knows what he's doing. Very flying. I don't know how it looks on Twitch. Because last time I did this, it was like proper laggy. It looks good on YouTube though. Hopefully Twitch is fine. I'll check. Like, last time I streamed, I just had loads of complaints about the Twitch quality. It's like, mate, I can't do anything about it. Like, YouTube's working fine. I don't even know what to say. I will check Twitch now though. Oh, the game loaded. Sick. Let's see. 1080p source. Oh, okay, it looks alright to be fair. We'll see when I start flying. But for now, that's all good. Cool. That's what we like to see. It's fine, but it's the smallest webcam I've seen. It's all good. We'll make it bigger. Why haven't you changed shit about my webcam? Whoop. Ugh, oh, my nails. There we are. <laughs> Is that good? Callum? good. That's good, my friends. But you can see the flight plan there. We've just got all that all written out. Sick. Um, okay, let's go to Katowice. From Echo Papa Kilo Tango. Oh, it's dark in Katowice at the moment. So it's just getting dark here, so yeah. Let's see what gate we want. Uh, what stand do we want? Say this one, why not? Stand 14. Okay, we don't want that. We want the PMDG 737 700. Look at that buzz, perfect. Hopefully, the winds aren't too bad because I don't have rudder pedals or anything like that, so this makes it a bit more difficult. Oh, I forgot about my webcam. <laughs> you don't want to be seeing me that big. I can just make that a bit smaller. I know you love to see my face, but. Come on, go smaller. Move myself over a bit so that you can't really see the yoke. Why am I so big? Wait, you don't. Look how pro streamers roll. Now, nah, someone in the Discord just told me why am I so small, and I took a bit of offence to it, so. That, my friend, is why I'm so big. Like that. Is why okay. I think it looks alright. It's a little bit bigger than before. A little bit bigger than before. That's all right. Um. Yeah. Cool. Let me just check this on my laptop. See how the stream looks. It don't look bad. Uh, I forgot about this as well. Let's sort this out. More. Where's recommended? Fly Live Studio. We'll just plug in some flight details here so the overlay works. We are on a 737, it knows, sick. Uh, departure, IKO is Echo Papa Kilo Tango. Echo Golf, Sierra at Sierra is our arrival. Call sign is Magic Sun. <laughs> 7932. I love that. There's no way the call sign's Magic Sun. But that's what that's what um thingy says. Where is it? Wikipedia. The winds on that's what VRB oh variable oh at two knots oh yeah that's fine that's perfect that's what we like to see 
Yeah, cool. So variable at two knots. That's fine. So now hopefully the overlay's working. Sick. That's what we'd like to see. Okay. Let's go do some flying. I think I've filed my own plan with that and everything like that. I've got our V pilot all loaded up, like here. Which is good. Okay. Let me just open up some charts. I'll do this on my laptop. See, I'd like you to see them, but it's just it's just a bit long in it. I don't be like alt tabbing. I am sorry for everyone who wants to see the charts, but it's not your lucky day. Um, we've got JFK open at the moment. We're going to open up Echo Papa Kilo Tango Taxi Aerodrome chart. Let's be in that. Got our SID. I'm not sure what SID we're on. Let me check. We're on the number two mic departure. Cool. Wait, on what runway? 27. Cool, let's pin that. And I think that's what we need for now. We'll get stancid charts up later on. Can't be bothered finding them now. But yeah, that's all good. It's all good in the hood. Although, they don't seem to want to load. Let me turn off my ad blocker, see if that makes a difference. Otherwise, we might be taxiing around with no with no charts, which is fine. It's fine. I forgot to write down what stand we were. Shit. Oh, it's dark. Okay, we need to fly. Um, is the game crashed? No, good. Oh, we're not even at a terminal. Okay, well, that's us. Why? Horrible. Breathing. Turn that shit off. Um, where even was it? Land in applause. I turn that off. So it's just like this is such a good add-on. I turn sneezing off. Look. Hmm. Okay. Toilet flush. That's another one. Makes you feel a little bit strange. Wind ambience. Turbulence. Okay. It looks like we're just gonna have to deal with it. To be honest. <laughs> that's cool. I guess. Is this sort of sorted itself?
we're going to have to deal with normal microphone for now. Webcam, I don't know what's up with that. It's frozen on quite an unflowering picture of me, but that's all good. I suppose. Hmm. Let's change that to this. Okay. Interesting. The webcam is just not working at all. Maybe that's what made broadcast crash in the first place. What is wrong with it? What's happening? And why is OBS using 80% of my GPU? We're going to have to carry on with that webcam, I'm afraid, guys. It's just not its not working out. It's closing video broadcasts like that shit. Don't save Notepad. You, no, cancel. There we are. Alright, I think we're good. We're ready to be flying. I think my input's a tiny bit too loud as well. It keeps on peaking a bit. Okay, cool. Alright, that looks good to me. I think it's still peaking, but... Yeah, I'm sorry. I was having problems with my webcam. I don't know what's up with it, to be honest. And for some reason, it's, I'm just getting like 2 FPS in the sim. I, d I don't know what's happening. I might have to restart the stream. I've never had this happen before. Like, I'm beyond confused. Apparently it's OPS using like 80% of my, um, of my thingy. I've never once had OPS used that much. I'm sorry, I know you love my sexy face, but there's nothing I can do. Chat, overlay. Right, so I've, let me just unplug my webcam completely, see if that makes a difference. I've already been streaming for half an hour, bloody hell. What on earth, mate? What's happening? OBS, why are you, what are you playing at? It's only 1.4% of CPU, but... Epoch cam, let's just close that completely, to be honest. Okay, OBS. Let's see... Video encode GP zero. Let's turn the bitrate down a bit. I think maybe that's maybe that's a shout because this is literally just unplayable. Like I can't deal with this. Um, Sayings. It's probably unwatchable as well. No one wants to see this. Uh, stream. Server auto detect output. Okay, let's set that to maybe five thousand kilobits per second. I don't know if that's going to look too bad or whatever. But the quality looks really good at the moment. So, just bring it down just, just a tad, maybe. Let me just full screen this. Full screen on my laptop so I can like see what it looks like. What good content, guys. My one viewer's loving this. He's loving it, mate. And how could you not? I say one viewer, it could be more on Twitch, because that's YouTube I'm looking at. And, oh, we've got a viewer on Twitch and a viewer on YouTube, bloody hell. That's what we like to see. Stream, live, recording, inactive, drop frames, whatever. So you're at 5,000 bitrate right now. Hopefully that makes it... No, what is happening? Let's turn on a flashlight. What is going on? Okay, let's just restart. Main menu, continue. I'd be surprised if Tower are even still on now. Maybe it's just my cat of its a scenery. I mean, I've used it before. I've never streamed it. Yeah, my GPU's still proper high because of OBS. What is this? What's this doing? Desktop. Oh, desktop. Okay, fair enough. Okay, well, OBS isn't using as much as it was. So, that's right, I guess. Okay, let's try again. Let's try one more time. If not, we'll have to go somewhere else. Let's actually try and go to a terminal this time. 
So do stand 22, Katowice. Let me write down stand 22 so I can remember. Stand. Oh, my pen's not working. St cool. What professional streamer, guys. Stand 22. That's what we like to see. Cool. I'm going to try to get my um, webcam back up and running in a minute. Let's just uh, see how it goes first. See how it goes. We'll put on some music in a bit too. Uh, I just want to sort of like get the ATC sort of over and done with for now. Like get my own clearance and everything. Makes life a bit easier. Okay, FPS is looking tremendously better. Maybe it was just NVIDIA broadcast. Um, okay. Yes, look at that. That's good. Cool. It's a pretty nice looking airport as well, actually. I'll quickly go back to that. Oh yeah, I just moved it off to the side a little bit. Okay, cool. Let's um, connect to VATSIM before we do anything else. We are RYS Magic Sun 79923. We are um, a B737. I can show you this. We're a B737. We don't need a cell cal code today. So we're just going over Europe. Connect. There we are. Let's quickly get our ATIS for Katowice if it's online. ATIS, Echo Papa Kilo Tango underscore ATIS. Okay, let's see. Don't know if he's still online. No, I don't think he is. Okay, that's a shame. I was looking forward to having um ATC at the airport. Oh well. Either way there's no ATC in um Stansted, so it's not much of a loss. That's a shame. But we live on. We live on. Alright guys, we're here. We're starting it properly. Should I give the webcam another go while I'm at it? <laughs> kind of like sick this I got a um a new add on. Like add like wear and stuff. So look how realistic this looks. Holy shit, like Like the fact that dirt like reflects on the lights, like the grease, like the finger grease and stuff. Oh that's sick. Okay. It looks so real. I need to change these back to normal. I have a controller somewhere too, where is that? <laughs> Get a little like external cam action. Oh. What enough? It's gone. What? My brother probably took it back because it was his. But that's so weird. Because he's only got one controller there. Did I just lose my brother's PS5 controller? Maybe. Oh, I was looking at it the old time. Ignore me. It's right in front of me. Hello, just pop in to watch him flying. Yes, exactly. You're here for the right reasons, my friend. Gonna be listening to some bangers in a minute. Doing some flying and nothing more. Nothing more, nothing less. I did have a webcam a minute ago, so you could like see my pretty face doing the flying, but it stopped working. Um, yeah, let me quickly open up. Let me quickly get my controller working. And yeah, today we're going from um, Katowice to Stansted. It's a real flight, a flight I've actually been on, which is cool. What am I doing? Um, let me just move this to the side. Actually, I don't really see it in my files. Oh, you could anyway. Is it in document? Yeah. I open up this so I can use um, a PS5 controller with the flight simulator just so we can get some nice drone cam footage which is always good to see what's what's happening it's all going wrong guys it's all going wrong for some reason the controller ain't even here yeah of course of course we've got a sound from the game turned on at the moment it's just um we ain't started anything up at the moment we're using the uh, PMDG 737 700 Right, I just got at it to read my chat. I'm reading the chat. What is there to read? I'm just getting like angry messages on Discord. What's happening? What's happening? Oh, unless the stream's paused. No, it ain't. 
strange. Why is this not working, guys? What's what's going on? Why does nothing work? Really? Want? No, hang on. Yeah, I clicked the wrong thing. There we are. <coughs> Done. Wait, is sound from the game not working then? Default. Let's have a look at the livery we got today. I just installed this. We got the uh, the buzz livery, which is nice to see. Apparently, the call sign for this is Magic Sun, which is great. I can't wait to write, bring up ATC like Magic Sun. This might actually have been the gate I was at. It looks about right. That's sick. I actually have a. Oh no, we can't look out the windows. Actually, can we? I doubt they're transparent on this. They are sick. Yeah, I actually have a picture, like, right, standing, literally right here. That's always cool to see. Okay, let's actually start the plane now. Um, we connect it to VATSIM. There's no control on. There was a minute ago, but we had some sort of teething issues at the beginning, so... Yeah, it's what it is. So, first things first, let's turn on our battery. Arm our emergency exit lights. Then before we do anything else, I'm going to turn on our panel lights, just so we can see once we connect to ground power. Uh, yeah, should be good. Okay, cool. Go to ground power. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Um, before we do anything else, I'm going to set up my FMC. It's pretty early, I know. Better sort of get over and done with it. It's the most boring part, so I don't want to like, get people in and then lose them. We'll do it as quick as we can. We'll import from Simbrief as well, if we can do just to make the whole thing a bit quicker. Yeah, it's all good. I think I have the keybind set up. I do, nice. Oh, let's... Let's set our... There they are. Let's set these to nav. Uh, how long is that going to take? It's probably about seven minutes or so. It's not too bad. Cool, let's load up our fuel and everything like that. I'm going to move this to the side a bit. So I'm on double monitors, there's like a bar in the middle. So like, if you ever wonder everything's off center constantly, that's why. Oh, I'm still getting told to read my chat. I don't know what's wrong. Let me open up the Twitch stream, see if it's just not syncing them. Are you able to turn on the uh, the AC? Yes, I probably should. Uh, actually, I can't because the APU's not running. Let's see. We might be able to. Turn our packs auto. I don't know. Also, might have worked. I'm not sure. Okay, so we'll get this over and done with. Then we'll get our APU turned on. Everything like that. Then we can do some proper flying. Some proper flying. I don't remember how do you turn. Is it this? Okay, cool. And let's turn some panel lights as well. Just so we can see. Turn a little bit of background light, not much. Because I think it just looks super cool having just the. Um, oh, that's a floodlight. No, we don't. Should we have a little bit of that? I love these new textures. Like, just look at the background. Like, you can see, like, the light reflecting off of the dirt and things. So, so nice. Like, look at these buttons. Never been so excited about grimy buttons before. But, there we are. Grimy buttons for days. That's what we have. So, yeah, FMC time. Um, let's go. FS actions. First, we'll start off by setting our fuel and everything like that. I've got my uh, flight plan up, my laptop. Uh, block fuel is 7417. Not too much. Actually, I don't think that's going to be enough. I say 8000, there's no harm in it, I guess. It probably is, but. It's jokes, isn't it? It's jokes. 
So, payload. Let me see what our zero fuel weight is. Estimated is 53283. 53 53.3. 53.3, we'll shove that in there. Return, return, okay. Nav date, right, date, whatever. Pause in it at the moment, right, Echo Golf Kilo Tango. There we are, so IRS position, let's go next page, get our left GPS, plug that on in there. IP IRS position, origin, disagree. Oh, of course, I entered the, um, we're not Echo Golf Kilo Tango, we're Echo Papa Kilo Tango. We're not in the UK today, boys, we're in Poland. There we are. Perfect. That should all still be fine. Next page. Let's go to our route, obviously. Go. Can I request my flight plan? Oh, I have to install it. Really? I'll see if I can do that. No, it's not a long flight. I should have to enter it manually. I'm sure much everyone's dismay because it is boring. What are we going to do? Echo Golf, Sierra, Sierra. We are Magic Sun 7923. Romeo, Yankee, Sierra. 79023. Put that in there. Runway. Let's have a look. Pretty sure it's yeah two seven. Runway two seven. Next. Okay. Next page. Um, from. Well, we're taking the Tango seven three eight. Tango seven thirty eight. Invalid entry. How? Tango 738. Let's try to patch our rivals first, actually. So we've got like a sort of baseline. 27, perfect. We're on the number 2 mic. Okay, I have found this we're on like outdated nav data. Sometimes the number, especially in Poland, it's like 1 or 2, 1 higher or lower. So the number 3 mic route. Oh, yeah. I don't know what was up with that. To number then Tango 738 to Lassis Lassis I'll put some music on actually we can listen to that got some absolute bangers lined up for you today um, definitely copyrighted but it's jokes whatever hope it ain't too loud some proper like UK specialty guys so like if you're not into it, don't want to hear it. It's a bit loud, isn't it? A vision that hurts and the skirt is clean. Suspicion for the thirst, but the thirst was winning. I regret this in the morning. Shots of the road. That's reaching me. I'm glad I'm not that guy. Okay, if it's too loud, let me know. To Lassius, let's get the old flat plan back up. Direct to go backs. Go backs. Direct to Larrett. Larrett. Okay, maybe this isn't. <laughs> maybe this ain't the play at the moment. We'll um, wait till we get in cruise. And I get the webcam back up. I'm like, I'm proper fucking like raving. You know, can't be doing that like pre flight checks. I have the um, checklist printed out somewhere, but I don't know where it is. Direct to Nigog? I haven't heard that one before. Uh, N I G U G? Nigog? That's a weird waypoint. Direct to Nogro? <laughs> Nigog to Nogro. Make it out as you will. Um, Okay. Cancelled to Nogro. Then we take the M40 to IDC. The M40 to IDESI. 
I D E S I. Mate, it feels good to be in a Boeing again. Like I did um, an Airbus flight the other day, and the yeah. the MCDU or the FMC is just it's just so difficult. Okay, cool. That's it. Let's watch for arrivals. Stance did. We're on the ILS two two. And our star is Idesi One Alpha. Let's see if we can find it. Interesting. Um. Okay. Idesi One Alpha to Romy Two Two. Huh. That is strange. So we have to change that, I guess. Let me quickly look at Sim Brief again. Because that ain't it. Let's just see if there's any other options that sort of fit into our plan as it is. Okay, create new flight. Kapapa, Kilo Tango, Echo Golf, Sierra Sierra. Hopefully it generates it already, perfect. Idesi to the Idesi 1 Alpha. What's this? Rinis? Okay. Zoom in here, let's see what the difference is between this. Ah, come on. Give us some pace, mate. To Rinis. Ah, oh, there we are. I shit's online. What options do we have? Do we even have a Rinis here? No. We might just have to vector ourselves, but I really don't want to be doing that, honestly. The IDES 1 Alpha. Because I'm not seeing anything about that. Um, where is it? Oh, it ain't here, obviously. I dare see. That's so weird. I think we'll worry about it later on. Like, when we're in the air. Because at the moment, this... <laughs> obviously, the stream's getting pretty boring as it is. So, <laughs> let's activate that. Execute. Execute. Cool. So our performance in it. Should I get my camera working again? I think. I think that's what the world needs right now. Is a bit of my face in it. No. That's the wrong. I'm an idiot. It's guys. Today's been too long. I can't even. Say that like, I got up earlier than eleven o'clock. It's all right. It's all right, guys. Don't worry about. Don't worry about it. Oh, my phone died. That's probably why it broke earlier. Okay, that's cool. Let me just change this over. Hopefully it actually works this time. Because earlier it crashed and ruined everything. Alright. Cool, hopefully that you can still hear me. Nice camera. Ain't working, we'll deal with that later, you know. When my phone charges up again. Alright, so, our cruising altitude today will be... Da -da 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 -da. Hang on a minute, let me get my uh, stream here so I can see the chat. There we are. It's flight level 380, it's quite high. Cruise altitude of 380, our cruise wind will be... 253 degrees at 42 knots, really? Okay, fair enough. That's a lot of knots. No way that's the case. It's like in caveats right now, just for reference.
We've got two knots of wind. Mental. So our cost index of six, Ryanair standard. Our reserves are. We'll look at the old plan. Is one nine four three. So one point nine. Our zero fuel weight today is um, five three point three. There we go. Cool. M one limit. That should be fine. Let's execute this. Insufficient fuel, really. I did say that earlier, didn't I? Huh. That is strange. I said that a minute ago, didn't I? Unless I entered the airport wrong on Simbrief. No, I didn't. It says block fuel 7417. Which just is not enough at all. Can I get like a. Let me see this. Has this changed anything? Fuel facts up either or Let's just create the same route again. So we'll get to sort of like rethink it. Mate, I swear I've got nothing but problems at the moment. Why is nothing going right? Just trying to like, you know, do some flying. That's literally it. Come back in an hour and maybe we'll be ready. <laughs> no, don't do that, please. Please. 77, 700. Okay. Um, I can't bother. I changed my alternate on the final one because it just seemed too far away. But I mean, we're in a sim. It's unlikely we're going to need an alternate airport. So keep it like that. How much fuel is this recommending then? Is there a fuel weight take? Wait, block fuel still says eight thousand. Insufficient fuel. It's right. That isn't enough. Uh, a transition altitude in Poland is 5,000, so I'll put that there. Why am I? You know what? As much as it sucks, I think I'm just going to leave that for now. And then, what we'll do... What we'll do is... You know, let's set it to 9,000. Might as well. Then if that ain't enough, we'll reload fuel in the middle of flight. Not realistic, and I don't really want to do it. But I want to follow our sim brief as best as I can. Minute ref. Okay. So the error's gone. But I think it might have just disappeared anyway. Still want to take off. We've got f 5 degrees of flaps in a Boeing. It's been a little while. I think so. Um, CG. It should calculate itself for us. Perfect. Trim 671. I'll do that before I forget. Oh, my flashlight's still on. I'll turn that off. I don't like it. 6.71 Come on, hurry up a bit, please. If you don't mind. If you don't mind, Governor, we're trying to run a rally stream here. Mate. Why's my parking brake off? 6.71 Okay, trim set. Let's get our, um, not our V-speeds yet, we're going to get our runway wind. It's annoying, let me see if I can get ATIS information. Echo, Papa, Kilo, Tango, ATIS. Um, variable at two knots. Basically none. Can you just enter a variable in here? No, you can't. How do you do it? Can I just say slash two? No. You know, I'll just say zero slash two for now. There's like hardly any wind anyway, so it's it's, it's fine, I think. Yeah. Drive course, 
runway slope, I'm not too sure. Our heading is 265. Good to know, let's just set our V speeds. VR today is 131. Okay. Cool, I guess. What's our heading again? 265. I'll just set that here before I forget. 265. There we are. Look at that. Perfect. Oh, what's happening? What is happening? So we're all like four. Okay. Oh, we're almost ready. We're almost done with the MCDU now. The boring parts almost over. Glad to say. Let's have a look at all this. Climb, yeah, cruise, yeah, whatever. It's what it is. Descend. Many legs. We can have a look at our thing quick, our plan page, see if it's all mapped out. Plan. Op 4. Okay, let's just step through it. So there's what. No, that is a bit strange. What's happening? Let's zoom out a bit. Huh? What's going on here then? Did I enter my thing wrong, maybe? Let's check the flight plan. To Alpha. To Lassis, Gobax, Laritz. So, Exec is, yeah. Talassis, direct go backs, direct Lariat, direct. Oh, it's RKN, not RKT. Okay, that explains it. Professional streamer is what we are. Professional pilot, really. Um, can I. R K N. Put that in there. Both of these are very far away. It is R K N, right? Larry director R K N. Um. This one's closer. So let's go with this one. Discontinuality. Oh yeah, we don't want... Clear, maybe? What? Will you let me clear, maybe? How do you... Oh, why is it so long? Clear. Do I need to hold it? I don't know if I'm missing something here. I might need it, it literally says a raise right here. I removed the wrong thing, didn't I? Oh, uh, am I really going to have to Google how to use a 737? I think I might. 737. Remove weight went from FMC. Like it's got to be easier than. Press the legs page. To leave oh, you have to hit the legs page, really. Why? Well, that doesn't work either. RKT. Oh, what is happening? The closer one. 
Next page. No, RKT is still there. Oh, what's happening? God. Ah. Right. Next page. Why is there a discontinuality there? Oh, wait, no, we, we know about that one. That's fine. That's alright. Our beef is with this one. Right, I don't want to so go to the next page, hit delete. Everyone's just saying right over it, but that does not work. Like at all. RKN. This one. Next page. It's still there. Is it still there? Go away, please. What is happening? I'm completely lost right now. I swear you literally just press clear and then like it should go into the scratch pad, shouldn't it? Oh wait, there's a delete button. I don't, want to <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. I'm to delete. How do I get rid of this discontinuity then? Let's get rid of that. Wait. Okay, so for the few people still here, which I doubt there's too many of you, after that whole. No. RKN still isn't it. Are you joking? The flight plan says RKN. Okay, there's, there's another RKN. Let's try that one. Ah, uh, to think I thought this whole sale would be quick. Maybe I'm just too used to Airbus. Maybe that's the problem. Romeo. Give up. That's the worst words that's ever come out of my mouth, by the way. Okay, let's do this first one. Exec. Yeah, that's the right one. A little root discontinuality never out no one. Exec. Okay, perfect. We sorted that out. Finally, it's sorted. That's what we like to hear. Um, yeah, that's fine. We'll do that later. Okay, cool. It's about time. MCU's all set, I think. Hopefully. Let's check our takeoff. Okay, cool. Right, I think now we're ready to actually do some fun stuff. Obviously, there's no control on at the moment. So let's go to one two two decimal zero. No, one two eight decimal two. Wait, I had a little brain for it. What is Unicom? I should probably know this. One two two decimal eight. Literally, I didn't. I didn't say that once. <laughs> That's good to hear. I'm a professional, guys. I'm a professional. One two two decimal eight. Let's put that on. I'm going to see if I can get my webcam working quick before we do any anything dras drastic. Cause, I mean, who doesn't want to see my pretty face? Uh, 
Um, ain't working, guys. Ain't working. I'm gonna give this a few minutes. If it works, great. If it doesn't, then oh, I think maybe I uninstalled this actually. Cause it didn't work in. Let's speed run. What? Okay, how long has my mic been broken? Be honest. How long have I been streaming now? Fucking hell, an hour. I'm not even in the air yet. What can I say? I'm a professional. Camera's changed. Restart the camera and the application's using it. This is crashed again. I'm gonna cry. What is happening? Guys, I'm literally about to cry. Honestly. Maybe it does work. Maybe it's just tricking me. Nope, it's frozen. That's cool, I guess. Video capture. You know what? Attila's a real one. He's been with me the whole time. I respect that. I've, <laughs> I've been messing around doing nothing for an hour. Attila, he's, he's been here with me the whole time. Respect. We, I promise you, we're going to do some flying in a minute. Okay, soon. Do you guys really need to see my face at the end of the day? I think you should. Okay, let's just close NVIDIA Broadcast completely. Get rid of it. No, I don't want to close. Okay. Where is it? New capture properties epoch cam. I'm gonna put that here. I'm not. I don't like the background at all. So I might just get rid of it. Also, it's very laggy. For now, it's all right, I guess. <laughs> you can tell I'm not a real pilot, eh? It's alright, I figured out that big delete button in front of me. It's fine. I worked out in the... Oh. Okay, maybe webcam's a no-go. Not even that. <laughs> We're almost there, guys, I promise. So close. We are so, so close. Interesting. Is it OBS again using? Yeah. Video and code. 
Oh, I remember why that was. Um, because it's still actually using the webcam, even if it, even if you don't want it to, it still uses it. So if you just completely close this, so the webcam ain't connected, then hopefully I should. See, yeah, there I sorted itself out. We're one step closer. Okay, so I think now let's actually do some flying, yeah? Let's um let's check see if this is running. Yeah, cool. Just add some new like cool sounds and camera effects and things like that. Which is always nice. Let's um your damper on which we don't need that on yet, whatever, don't matter. Okay, let's switch on the APU. That do its thing. Let's assume we've finished boarding, so we're gonna go menu FX actions doors. Let's close this door. Go ground service. Let's remove our chocks. Um Do you need chocks to have ground power on? Ah, uh, whatever. Our, our APU's almost started now. It's that matter. What's that beeping? I did forget to turn this on. That ain't fire, is it? What? What is going on? Yep, you started yet. Okay, cool. That's what we like to see. Let's turn our hydraulics on. Let's 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 run through some tests. Actually, I never really do. I should. Cause it's always fun to do. We've got any tests to do here? Not really. Um, let's do our flows. Actually, your damper on. Fuel pumps, turn them on. Let's do these, that's all fine, that's all good. Let's turn our pro peats on. Let's turn our packs to off. ISO valve open. Let's test this. One, two, three. There you are, the green light shows. Means we're all good there. Let's go back down here, let's test our fires. Check this. I don't know what that does, I just know you do that. Cool. Um, okay. Can I please? Maybe if I sit here. No, don't do that. Whew. Yeah, let's go. Okay. That's all for testing now, I think. APU's turned on, all things like that. Good. Um, I think we're good up here. Okay, let's do a pushback. Cockpit to oh, ground. No, stop, stop, stop. This is ground. Stand by. Ground, please cancel pushback operation. Roger, pushback cancelled. It's a really good add-on, by the way, because they're like toolbar pushback. It's like um, it's like the X-Plane one. What runway are we on? Does it, s does it actually say the names on here? It should do, hopefully. So I'm not sure which way we're actually pushing. That's 09. Okay, so we need to go the other way. Cool. Let's very precariously scroll this over here. Okay, yes, we want to push to about here. 
Oh, look at that, enter. Quest pushback. Cockpit to ground. This is ground, stand by. Cool. Oh, I'd like to find let's turn logo light on. Steady to steady. Good. Okay, let's turn this to left. Let's switch these over. FMC. Okay, sir. The bypass pin is installed. All doors and hatches closed and all ground equipment is removed. The parking brakes are set. You may lift. Parking brake set. Lifting the aircraft. Let's quickly set these. Our course 265. We'll set that 2652. We are cleared for start and push. Okay. Cleared for push start. Please release parking brake. Yeah. Parking brakes are released. Start engine 2. Commencing pushback. You can start the engines in sequence. It will start in the sequence. Oh, I forgot. APU bleeding to go on. Please turn off. Our uh, V2 is 138, so let's set this to 148. Let's introduce fuel into that engine. Let's set altitude to our transition, which is 5000. Oh, listen to that engine go. Okay, push back completed. Please set your parking brake. Yeah, exactly. He's just been sitting there patiently. Set parking brakes. Oh. Set parking brake. Parking brake set. Parking brake set. Lower set the other ground. engine. Listen to that. It doesn't matter how many times I fly, it just makes it that's so good. I never get up to, uh, bored of that. So on the runway turn, I set everything on. Uh, Anti-collision on. Turn so wheel well on, might as well. Cool. Landing lights will go off for now. Let's see, engine 1's generating power. Engine 2 hasn't fully sired yet. Mainly mostly because it doesn't have any fuel. You should probably turn that on. Yeah. I cannot wait for the um, 77-800 to come out. There we are, cool. They're both making power, so that means we can switch these on. We can turn the APU off. We can turn on our engine bleeds, APU bleed off, packs to auto. ISO valve auto. We can hear that aircon coming on. Now we should be ready to taxi. A set fl flaps 15, before I forget. No, flaps 5, not 15. Perfect. S check um, our takeoff warning config. Cool. Okay. Um, no, let's, let's lock our door. Don't want anyone getting in. <laughs> Where's our TCAS? Let's turn that to TA only. Okay, I think we're ready to go. Finally, guys, we've seen some action. Um, we 
quickly get some information off of here. Yeah. Okay, well, um, if they're on Unicorn, I'll just let them know. I'm taking off. Magic Sun, 7923, taxi and runway 27. Okay. Let's give us some power. Turn the parking brake off, it might help. Let's go. I'm gonna taxi over to the line. For some reason this plane does have some issues with taxiing smoothly. Sometimes it just doesn't want to go at all. So it's not my fault when I go veering off <laughs> off into the grass. Yeah, see it's like really pulling. Let's let's go down here. Oh, and this doesn't take me onto the runway, does it? I hope not. It mustn't. So we're on taxiway Alpha at the moment. Let's go on to Hotel 4. Okay, cool. It all seems to be working out so far. I don't understand why it's pulling so hard. It sounds top of that. I've got to do a fly control check. We can do that now while we're right. Oh wow, I can control it on the ground on my yoke. I had no idea. Okay. Let's be careful with that. Oh, I think I just removed some flaps. Okay. Let's turn that to rejected takeoff. Wow, it really is pulling really hard. I don't know why that is. Uh, that might be a bit of a problem actually. Cause that's going to give us issues on the runway. On takeoff. Yeah, why is it putting so much? Look. This is me, like, not touching anything. Got a nice look at the tower over there. I can already tell, it's going to make takeoff really difficult. So now flight director's on, I've got to do that. Let's arm up auto forty. That means we can turn on VNAV and LNAV. Just get that ready for our departure. Okay guys, we're almost there. There's a runway. It's about time, eh? It's about time. <laughs> We're probably quite delayed, but... There's an A380 over there for some reason. Why is there an A380 at Katowice Airport? Who knows? Why is it drifting so bad? Okay, we're good.
We're good. At least I hope so. Turn on our landing lights. Let's turn off our taxi lights. But oh, that's the APU light. Oh no, don't turn the APU on, please. strange. Um, cool. I think we're good. Ready for takeoff, I think. Okay. Let's just let ATC know. Kind of it's a traffic. Um, Magic Sun 7923 taking off from 827. Okay, let's go. So um, let's start off, 50% N1. Stable. So good. Pushing those down a bit. Eighty knots. One hundred. V1, V1, rotate. Positive rate, gear up. Perfect. Let's turn off our taxi lights, run we turn offs. Let's enable what autopilot. Oh, now it's going to start following the plan for us, which is good. Nice. Let's turn off our auto brakes. Let's go up to flaps 2. Okay. Switch to TARA. That's it, I think. For now. Okay, let's set our let's set our Q and H to standard. Why is it bouncing up and down like that? Let's head out to our cruise, which is 380 today. Crash, no. <laughs> I wouldn't. We're on Vatsim anyway, so I can't. I mean, I might crash on accident. I mean, given how poor that sort of takeoff config was, you never know. Look at this. What a sexy plane. No, I'm going to ignore altitude restrictions because I want to. Let's, let's just pretend ATC cleared us for this, yeah? We're going to climb straight to our cruise. What a cool plane.
Oh nein! Das sieht aus eins mein Ort. <lacht> okay, that's not good. Oh well. Let's hope someone let's hope no one's hurt themselves. Okay. Nearly at 10,000, so I'll turn off our landing lights. Also, turn off fast and seatbelt signs. We'll see if we can clean anything else up in the cockpit. I think basically covered. Yeah. Let's check and see if you have any ATC coverage upcoming. Yeah, R Y S. There we are. Here we are. Okay. So basically, when I first started, there was ATC all over Europe, but somehow it's taken us an hour and a half to actually <laughs> to actually get into the air. It's all good. It's all good. We might not have any ATC, but we do have a lot of fun. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah, cool. Let's have a quick look at the outside. It's very nice looking. You can't stand up exactly, but you can like you can move around. Like, you can move the camera, it's just a little bit finicky. Here's, the, um, here's a better view of the cockpit, if you want to see that. It's nice to see. Let's go into the cabin. Oh, wait, that let us. Let's get our drone cam. Coming this way. Actually, let's go to the seat I sat in. I was here. I sat right at an emergency exit, like my window. It was good because I got like loads of extra leg space. As so I've done this exact flight before, which is really cool. Like, it's really cool to replicate it. I just wish it was a bit lighter. I would make it daytime, but it's just not realistic. Like, this is real time at the moment. Okay, we're still climbing and doing pretty good performance wise, though, which is good. Yeah? I'll put this here in case anyone wants to see it. That's our, um,. That's our V pilot. Actually, no, it takes up too much space. There is a window camera, but you have to set it manually, and like I'm not too sure how to do it. Like in this plane, I know um, in the Airbus know how to do it there, but this plane's a little bit strange. I'll Google it. Window view. 
Let's see. There, ha there definitely has to be a way. It does look nice in the dark, yeah. I can turn these lights to test as well, just to make everything like light up a bit colourful. Look at that. Oh, I'd love so much to fly a plane like this in real life. Like, imagine like in the dark, like everything. Like, it's just, it's so nice. But this plane is so detailed, like even like even this opens, which is the emergency landing gear, so we'll close that but because once you put the landing gear down with that you can't put it back up again. But yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to get a window camera. Because usually you need to go through the door, but it won't let me. So that's a shame. There's definitely a way to do it, like I've seen people do it. I just I just don't know how. The like, best we can do is precariously do this, but even so it doesn't stay, it moves. Which is a huge shame. Oh I forgot. They turn into the strobe. <laughs> oh yeah. No clouds at all. You right, Louis? How much did he drink? What? How much did he drink? Right, didn't you have like a glass of wine or something? much then, is what you're saying. Okay, well, I'm trying to fly a plane at the moment, if you don't mind. Uh, I suppose. I'm streaming though, that's the thing. I mean, you can watch the stream if you like, it's a pretty interesting one. Probably not, because my mic is um, filtering on. My horrible friend. No, he was in chat a minute ago though, he told me to crash. See the overlay and everything's working. Let's see, like I said, um, altitude, head, and things like that. The progress bar too. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I think now we're in cruise. I think it's time for the music. What do you think? I think so. I'm just confused, my Twitch has been a bit strange. Okay, sorry. We've got more interesting commentary coming up. We're going to be funny, we're going to be interesting, edgy, and made with a whole collection here on the Jack Weller channel. Let's see. So, basically, yeah, this is a plane, right? These are buttons and switches and that. We 
you don't actually need to touch any of them because, well, we're above 10,000 feet, so yeah, there we are. Oh, I forgot what my flaps are. I'm losing it today, what's happening? There we are, flaps are up. Oh, we were so close to overspeeding there for a minute, but we didn't, that's all that matters. much to do, like as far as being in the cockpit at the moment. Should I see what our um, ETA is? Is there a progress? I really don't think we have enough fuel, I'm going to be real. Oh, we have four, four guys on, okay. 2323 Zulu. Okay, that's not bad. It's 20 past midnight here in the UK. Yeah, that's not too bad at all. Not bad at all. I hope you guys realise well, we're going to absolutely grease this landing. It's going to be great. I've got a feeling it's going to be the best landing we've ever done, actually. Butter, I'm telling you. Look at what the moon straight ahead. Got a lovely view over. Oh, let me see where we're over actually. I don't think we're over Poland at the moment. We pass that. Yeah. Not really, thanks anyway. I just got offered a strong mint. Alf, I would not want two strong mints, but thanks for the offer. Yes, that in the microphone. Why have I got a microphone? Yeah. That's my old microphone, it really does sound good. I think it fell out the wardrobe so I put it on my desk. The old mic I had was really good actually, I wish I am. Um, I'm, I'm going to buy another one at some point. Yeah, I'll use it at some point. I need to get a, um, a what is it, the thingy plug, like an amplifier or something. Okay, yeah, we are. We still are over Poland, by the looks of things. Is that Poland? Maybe, maybe not. So Cavit is here. We're like Krakow, Pip. We're probably just passing out of Poland into Germany. I don't know, I'm not sure. I'm not too much of a... I'm not too great at geography, to be real. Look at that, we've reached our, uh, reached our cruising altitude today. That's good. I love, I just can't wait for the M800 to come out, for the max. But I think it's going to be a little while, the, uh, the Dash 600 was supposed to come out any time actually, but it was delayed. So if that's delayed, the um, 800 will probably delayed as well. So that's a shame. Bars. I didn't know that that only existed until I actually had to get on a flight, or try to the right but like I went out to buy on the TA to get to the boat with these bars and then these days <laughs> that is so cool the airline has a massive B on the tail what is there not to love? it's really it's making buzz constantly also their call sign is Magic Sun I mean it's the perfect airline Magic Sun, and it's got a huge B on the on the thing. It's amazing, eh? Look at a nice like, camera angle. Wait for cruising. That looks alright. Maybe I'm a little bit too zoomed in. I don't know. That looks quite nice, actually. I just like to capture the pretty lights. You know? <laughs> I do like some pretty lights. Nice little camera angle while we cruise. Okay, thanks man, I really appreciate it. Yeah, I don't know, I'm not really much of like... A, I don't know, like a natural streamer. Like, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not funny, I'm not interested. But yeah, I thought maybe I'd just stream these. But yeah, thanks for that, I really appreciate it. Hope you're enjoying.
acting like I didn't shout at an FMC a minute ago. <laughs> Where's the delete key? Did it in the end? All that matters. Where are you from, Attila? I'm from um, the UK myself, from Essex. you're from Oslo. I was going to go to Oslo actually. I booked flights for it a few months ago but unfortunately I lost my job so I couldn't go in the end. No, Oslo is like definitely the next place I'm going. That's sick. That's so cool. So it just looks so nice. Like look at it, you've got like the mountains in the back and you're right. It's so cool. Just a nice looking city. already to be fair. 28,000, no, 618 miles to go. Oh, Heathrow Directors online. Gatwick Director, strange. I kind of want to get into um, doing the, uh, the air traffic control, but there's like a six month wait on my training. I signed up for it, so I'll get an email in about six months time, they said, but I might be over it by then, who knows. Yeah, it's real time. It's like live time, live weather, everything. Oh, look at that! I wonder who that is. I'll have a look in a second. Oh, I wonder where he's off to. That's so cool. I love seeing other planes, but it just makes it feel so much more alive. You have looked pretty lovely. Okay, that must be good here. Who's there? Who's going to watch other? Yes, who's going back to Poland? Where are we going from? I'd love to try and fly a bit of like an older plane, like um, an old 737 or something like that. Just a lot more involved. I'm not sure how I'd cope. As you can probably tell, everything else, um, I'm not the smartest. <laughs> I'd probably, I probably would do very good, especially on that timber. So I'd love to give it a go. 
Come, I actually have the Concord add on. But I've only thrown it once. Maybe I should try it again. Right, I'll try it on the back I was thinking of getting the um, adjust for like BAE 162, 142, I think it is. It's a really, really interesting plane. It's not one I've really heard much about, but seeing all like, the videos on the add on, so it looks like a really, really interesting plane. One four six. See, at first I saw it and like I didn't really like the look of it, but it's sort of grown on me. Like it's just like so stubby, like the four engine. I don't know. But I really did like it to start. And now I was just like, look at it. It's such like I don't know how to describe it. Like it's just such a likable kind of plane design. Someone's having a fire. Huh. St. Elmo's fire. Interesting. Why is he putting that in Unicorn? But yeah, well, <laughs> I wish him the best of luck with that. I can't really help. But, uh, yeah. It's got a really cool cockpit as well. Like it's just like a rubber switch on top. Like it's just like white switching would look so cool. I would make this full screen but I can't really because I want dual monitors. So you only end up seeing half of it. It's just such a nice looking plane. And I think it's a perfect gap between being old and yet still having a bit of that technology there. This will help me along a bit. It is INS. There's no FMC there, as you can probably see. I'm not sure how I'll cope for that, but... Oh wait, it does have an FMC. Interesting, maybe the newer ones have an FMC, the other ones don't. Okay, that's interesting. wonder how much it is, let me see. Last I checked, it was like £40, I think it was. Which isn't too bad for an add-on, like this quality. Yeah, fifty pound. Like it's such an interesting plane. It's one I'd really like to you know, give a go, like try and master. It's a really well-made add-on. It's a plane that's just really grown on me. As I say, I hated it at first, like the design of it. It's like look at it. It's so cute. Like it's so stubby with so like, four little engines. Like it's so cool. Yeah, it's with an older plane that's like, a bit more involved. That's sort of what I'm looking for. On this map, here we go. Yeah, we go up, we should turn around. Go. I think it's basically just straight over to Stansim. There's a knife for probably go over the Claxon waypoint, which is about here. So, we must go, yeah. I find it funny, like, knowing where the Claxon waypoint is, because I, I, I'm not going to say where I live, but I live really close to that waypoint there. So now, like, when I want a real plane, I'll know, like, if I, I know how to see my house at like, looking at the plane window. Let's see. Not that I've done that yet, but I'm hoping to do some more travelling soon. Like, I love to travel around, like, see different places, think of that. So, yeah, as I say, I was going to go to Oslo. I want to go, I went to Poland, like, um, a few months ago now. I want to go again. So I didn't, I don't feel like I saw it all. Like, Poland is such a... I wasn't expecting much, but there's so much in Poland. Like you've got beautiful towns and cities. And obviously you've got the other uh, mountains at the bottom. You've got Gdansk, which is really good looking, like on the seafront. Really cool. I'd love to like learn some Polish and go over there as well. So, because obviously like where I was going weren't touristy areas, so no one spoke English. So it'd be cool to like learn some Polish and go over there. <laughs> I remember. So as a general rule, the Poles were really really nice. Like everyone I spoke to, like. They were just really nice people, but there was this one lady in a train station. Like, obviously, I was getting my train ticket. I wanted um, I wanted to go back to Katowice, where I was staying. So, I literally said, Jeden Katowice, which is one Katowice. And she just said, You're in Poland, speak Polish. <laughs> like, what? for one, I did speak Polish. I said, one Katowice. And um, I said, 
I can't remember what I said. I said, oh, sorry, I don't know Polish. And then she just started serving the next person in the line. I'm like, what? What is going on? Like, did she not understand me or something? Like, so then I, I said, sorry, I one ticket to Katowice. And she just carried on serving the next person. The next person in the line was confused as well. I don't know what was going on. So I just like asked in the queue. I think it was like, I don't know, I remembered more Polish back then than I do now. I said something like, anyone speak Polish, like English, it was like, something, English, thank you, it don't matter. But yeah, someone there spoke English, so he went over and spoke to her in Polish, and she got me the ticket, but I was so confused. Now I was sort of taken aback. But yeah, I'm not sure what the point of that story was, like at all. Yeah, Poland, really nice place. Also, it looks really nice, I can't wait to go. Um, yeah. I really want to go to um, Finland, it's really nice. Sweden, uh, Iceland, it's beautiful, I'd love to go to Iceland. Yeah, just an endless list of places, places I want to go. I don't know how I got onto this topic, I mean I'm good at just chatting shit, just to myself. Where am I over right now? I'll check. I'm over... I think Germany. I'm not sure like where the border is. There's Berlin there. See, I must be over Germany. Which is cool. I mean, like, I'm not sure how far into Germany is Berlin. I think Poland and Germany are next to each other. I think. But as I say, my geography skills just aren't all that. But if they are next to each other, then yeah, I mean, oh, there's an airport here, I wonder where that is. We can actually see, I forgot about that, airport. That is... Where is that? VOR. No, not VOR. EDVB, I think that was. Let's see. EDVB. Oh, Berlin. Oh, we are over Berlin right now. That's Berlin there, I think. Cool. I'd love to see the runways, like, over there. So that must be Berlin there. Before there. Such a good place, I like the delivery. It's hard to get into Berlin. That is over there. That looks like a, a racetrack or something. See that in the middle? Interesting. It probably is. I don't know too much about it. It's so annoying, I can't get the webcam to work. Like, I feel like I just would have added like a whole other thing to the stream, but... That's yeah, right. And I feel like seeing my face would just add a whole other level, you know? It's just it's so good looking. But the problem is, you, you wouldn't look at the plane, you'd just be staring like the bottom corner of the screen. But, still. Still. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> you don't want to see it. I mean, just imagine someone who sits in my room at 11 o'clock at night on a Monday flying a plane. It's basically what I look like. <laughs> it's alright though. It's harder than I thought, it's just the talk. It turns out I'm not that interested and I don't have too much to talk about. So that's cool. <laughs> Someone put something in chat quick. Give me something to talk about. It's urgent. This stream's about to become boring because we haven't reached that point yet. It's about to. So someone. Who's at me in Discord? Have a look.
That's funny. I'm going to put it on the screen so you can see that. <laughs> Flight sim players explain my see and I'm watching the UI pilot. <laughs> For nine hours is fun. It's jokes. I disagree with him. It is fun, but... Such a good looking game. Look I'm breaking viewers in now as well, five viewers. Wow. I mean we was on one for the past couple of hours, but here we are. People are finally recognising me. The sad part is that I've just completely skipped the fun part. <laughs> you know, it's just me chatting shit for a couple of hours while we cruise. But it's alright, let's go back now. I forget you guys can't see someone dual monitors at the moment. Like cause, um, the whole view sort of wraps around me, so I can see more than you can. Yeah, the engines are loud. It's such a shame I can't set up like an interior camera on the window. It just won't let me. They're loud, they do sound good. Especially if, like, they sound different from the front and behind. Like, you can sort of hear the air. You know? So cool. Is that Berlin or is that somewhere else? Have you already passed Berlin? Definitely German, I'll tell you that much. It's made as small as you Yeah, so this is a bit behind. Oh interesting, apparently that isn't apparently Berlin's on my right side. Oh yeah, look at that, it is. Cool, I don't know where this is then. I've been saying it's Berlin the whole time, it's not. Yeah. It's another place I'd like to go, I just... I say I want to go to Germany because I want to just travel around. Like when I say I want to go somewhere, like I don't just want to... People say like, oh where there, I just want to go everywhere. Like in Poland I went to like, I stayed there for like a week and I went to like six different cities. You can't just go to a country, like, it depends what sort of holiday you're going on, but for the sake of travelling you can't just go to a country and like, stay in the same place. This in my opinion, so it, it just has so much to offer. Like especially Poland, it shocked me, like what, what there was in Poland. Like so much more. I didn't expect Poland to be all that, but it really was. So yeah, more of the story is, if I was going to Germany I'd travel to all different places. Especially like with these European countries as well, is the public transport is so good. Most of the time it's really cheap as well. So you can get around like no problem.
I can't in Poland like there was a um, like a six hour train to Gdansk. I didn't go in the end unfortunately. It was like a six hour train. And it cost something like five pounds, five British pounds. It's like the train I'd get from Katowice to Krakow. It's like half an hour to an hour. It literally costs like two pounds. Like if that probably less to me, it's like one fifty. Like and it they were nice trains as well. Like to travel around, like there's no reason not to travel around. I so I bring up Poland like all the time because it's the only interesting thing about me. There's nothing else really there <laughs> to talk about. Because as I say, I'm just a guy who sits in the dark at 11 o'clock at night flying virtual planes. Yeah. The women love it, I tell you. They ask what do I do for a living, I say, uh, I'm a virtual pilot, mate. The thing is, what makes it so cool is like I feel like genuinely I could jump into a 737 right now and like be able to fly it. That's awesome. But like, you can get them at like the proper simulators. It's like a hundred pounds an hour, so I'm gonna go one day. Problem is, like the train out's like fifty pounds. Like once, um, so I just got a new job, so I haven't been paid yet. But once I get paid for that, I sort of like pay off my bills and everything. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to a 737 simulator because like, it just sounds so cool. Like to be able to like sit in a cockpit and like do everything that I've done in a sim. I can't wait and I think it'd just be so 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 fun. Like to do it sort of in real life. Like obviously I won't be flying a real plane, but it's the closest thing like I'm probably ever gonna get. Reset MCP altitude, how? It's on a cruise. Why well, don't wanna reset it? Okay. Okay, sorry, check on the target. Our cruise is 280, right? Why are they complaining? Ah, oh, whatever, we'll clear it. We will clear it. I don't care. Let's see if we've got um, our YouTube soon. It's strange, YouTube and Twitch, like, usually I get way more views on YouTube. Because I feel like maybe it's just in people's feeds more. No, today Twitch is, is really uh, working for me. I mean, yeah, I'll just stream on both, but there's no harm in it. Like, so at the end of the day, like, I don't have much of a community, so the people do it like Tom Cruise. <laughs> it's a nice one. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly right, as well, isn't it? Let's get a license. I will, I will get a license at some point. I am. Um, Again, once I get one, it all sort of lies on money, but I did do a lot of research into it. Like, I even called up the, um, I called up the, uh, the local flight school to me as well, like, it ain't too expensive, it's like, um, I think £120 for an hour and a half lesson. And that's an hour and a half airborne. So, like, that isn't, like, including the brief and everything like that. And, like, that's obviously the plane rented and everything like that, like, it's not bad. Like, for the sake of, like, £120 a week, and I'm on track to get a pilot's license. That's obviously just a PPL, so I'll be able to fly that like, general aviation plane and things like that. It really won't be expensive. I heard like the average, because obviously you need to pay for the tests and the exam and things, is about twenty thousand pounds all in, like for a PPL. Which if I'm doing it over the space of a year or two or three, I'd say that's that's pretty good. Like it's pretty good going. It's cheaper than I expected it to be. Obviously, if you want to start doing things like getting a Type rating in a 737, then you're looking at like 80 grand. But there's not really any reason to do that unless you want to be an airline pilot. But no, about 20 grand and about I don't know, a couple of years of work, like every every weekend, I took a lesson. So in a couple of years, I could have a private pilot's license, which would be amazing. Then I just need to do like a, a dual engine plane thing. Obviously, you do different things for different light types of plane. Yeah, look at that, there's another airport beneath us. I wonder what that is. That is Echo Delta Delta Papa. Should we see where that is? Oh, why do I always do this? Let's move the sides. Echo Delta Delta Papa. 
Leipzig? Leipzig? How? Huh? German ladies and gentlemen are fluent. It's really cool. I love seeing the airports from above, like they're just so bright. Look, we can actually see the pack. Oh wow. Oh no, don't worry. Wait. Oh no, that's taxi lights. I was so confused. I was like, are they the pappy lights? Like, separate them? No, they're not. That's just a holding point. Cool. Cool, yeah. I kind of feel like I'm missing something. Like, in, as far as the cockpit's concerned. I don't think I am, but... Let's see, you all down the door. We don't need to mess with any of that. What a few pump, fuel pumps run. Lights are set, runway turn off, taxi off, logo on, strobe, and inclusion. Okay, let's turn that off. That is the end of the world, that's fine. Well, blue world lights turned on as well. Obviously, the landing gear is absolutely much different. Oh, I love this sound, listen to this. Yes, yeah, seatbelt lights are off because we're on our cruise at the moment. Oh, I did forget this. This is a pressurization panel. Which actually, that's, the fact I didn't say that's quite dangerous. But, oh well. I said, what is our landing actually going to be? I think Stanton is 350. I could be wrong. No. This just um, lets, lets it pressurize. So we're cruising 28,000. And then the landing 350. Uh, hydraulic pumps on, anti ice we don't need at the moment, probe heat on, window heat obviously we don't need. Pretty hot in color at the moment actually. Let's see, engine heat on, uh, packs, that isn't awesome. What? You're telling me this entire time my packs haven't been on? There is no, no, they have, it's just the camera angle, okay. I was gonna say, it's a bit worrying. Now our packs are on, that's good. I actually think that is everything sorted. But there's nothing nothing that I could have done but yeah, yeah. Oh something I do need to do, I forgot about earlier, was um the arrival with the Stansted because it all just went a little bit weird, didn't it? Because we needed to go from a star which didn't actually exist. So let's just let's go to our legs. Let's just step through some of these sort of see what it looks like. There's Idesi. So we're supposed to take the Idesi to Alpha departure. Um, arrival I mean. But it turns out that just doesn't exist. Please take part for arrival, stance of arrival, ILS 22. Unless I'm just dumb and I'm missing here, but I really don't think we are. Okay, let me check what the arrivals are. So we're coming in from my desk. So let me just see what the arrivals look like. We can choose the one which is what best fits. Actually, no, let's go to Chart Fox. Chart Fox is an amazing website, by the way, if you haven't used it. Obviously, everyone uses Navigraph, but it's just, it's just too expensive for me at the moment. I will get it at some point, but for now, Chart Fox is really good. Because it is just gives you free charts for basically every airport. There's some it doesn't have, like some of the smaller ones, but it does the majority of them. Echo okay, Golf Sierra Sierra. Let's see the stars. Two, two. Is. Where have we going to? Yeah, ILS 2 2. That noise is this, by the way. People chatting in the I say chatting, they're giving. Yeah, they're two feet vacated for that. Funny, not many one well, unicorn, not many people speak, most of them just put the message in, which is fair enough.
it takes a can. Not that way. No, that's not really very helpful. You know what we can do? So we can just go direct. I think we can anyway. That's a that's a Not that it makes any difference. But if anything the view's gonna be whoa, that's nice over there. It's got like a tiny bit of like reflection onto the cloud. Okay, that's not the end of it. We're gonna be climbing now. Go to RKN, let me zoom in a little bit actually. So I can see the sort of arrival in more detail. It's RKN. Nigga, Kanogro, Musil, Brilliant, Adesi. Okay, so can we go. Oh, so the approach everything is. It looks alright going direct. If there was control online, maybe I'd be a little bit more careful with it, but. It's, okay. it's just because our nav date is out of date. I think that's a problem. But you need to, like, update every nav path, and you have to pay for that, which is annoying. So I, I missed some stars and like waypoints. So I've never missed a star before. Like a missing arrival, so I don't know. I don't know what's up with that. Unless I've got the runway rule or something, I really don't think I have. We're not climbing, what's that? Let's just turn on Vina. See if that does its thing. Yeah, why was Vina not on in the first place? It should have been. Yeah, there we are, we're climbing again. Yeah, that's strange. I don't know. I don't know what I was doing. Before I forget, let's... Oh, I close edge. Okay. Let's get our ILS frequency. Let's frequency. It's a really good website, by the way. Obviously, you can find it on the charts, but it's just a bit long. Check out ILS. 122. It is 2... Yeah, it is. 111.5. So let's set that here. Oh yeah. My ILS is set. Let's do that in the right hand one as well. Because as far as my way, they both need to be set. Let's actually work. 101.5. Perfect. Uh, course 223. Elevation 223. I remember that. I feel like 380 is awfully high. Like for a 737. Renes is quite a long route. I'm not, if anything, that might mean me using a bit more fuel than we should have done, and given the plane shouting at us earlier, that could be a bit of a problem. But um, we'll see. <laughs> if we run out of fuel, then yeah. it'd be interesting actually, like a bit of an emergency situation. I could get behind. Obviously, it'd be my fault, but it'd be it'd be interesting to say the least. And try and like affect myself to another airport. It'd be more fun if there was controllers online. Well, yeah, we just have to make the best out of a bad situation. Total five minutes seven. We are losing fuel very quickly. Um, we're gonna be really late. Um, late. We're gonna be really light on that as well. Which. I'm not very good at landing in the first place. I'll see what the weather is at Sandsby at the minute. I've got a bag of sweets here. So, give me a second. I just stop talking every now and again and we hear some munching. That's why. It's like an ASMR stream to turn into. No, I don't know if you want to hear that. Don't worry, I'll, I'll spare you. 
I'll spare you just this once. Let's see, what was I about to search? Something. Okay, I don't remember at all. There's something to the stance about me. That's it, the weather is that's it, you see. Oh, it's hitting the website. Um, well, it was turbulent at the Given the winds, I can see. I can see why. Thanks for a chance from stand to the drop zone. I might. I actually wanted to. And Norway would be a really nice place to fly into as well. So I think I will. That's a good shout. You from Norway as well? No way. So's um. So's Atala. Yeah, I'd love to fly to them in Norway. So most of the places I fly to are just pretty boring, like they're just like just completely flat. I'd like to fly somewhere with like a bit of review. Like so I mainly stick to flights that I've been on or but go to places I know. I don't know why. I should go to more places. But I'd like to ever fly around America a bit as well. But it sort of scares me because the ATC is just so different over there. Like you sort of have to learn like the whole thing. And like you don't ask for push and start clearance. You just kind of push yourself and then ask for. That seems so weird. Okay, anyway, let me get back on track. What are they doing? Looking for Atis. I swear it says Atis on this website somewhere. I remember seeing this website before. We're getting some mad turbulence, by the way. Yeah, okay, 308 knots is not too bad. Only getting a. Um, Is it really? That's interesting. Is it like a big airport or would we need a... You know what I'm thinking. That BAE I was going to buy, I think would be perfect to fly around the way. Let's have a look. Let's start with the, the length of it. Let's see what sort of plane would be appropriate. I'd love to fly that BAE over there. Oh, that is not I see it's at the top. So maybe that'd be fun, like a short little hop from Oslo to Tromso. Is it pronounced Tromso, by the way? Because I know, like... It probably isn't pronounced Tromso. Oh. Yeah, a little, uh, like a short hop from Oslo to Tromso would be pretty cool. In the um, BAE once I actually buy it, which I will. Okay, 737. Uh, what's it beeping at me for? My plane just beeped. Um. Okay. Plane. Is everything good, buddy? You seem to be beeping at me a little bit. Sort of scared me. Autopilot, everything's still working. Um, it all looks good. It all seems alright. I don't know. See, I'm not much of a pilot. I don't know. Even in the sim, I don't have many hours. Like, it's just little things like the beeps and things like that. I don't really know. See, short beep 737. We'd be Oh, that's not the way it's going. 
harder. I reckon it's fine. I reckon it's going to be okay. If it beeps again, then we'll panic. But yeah, so it's 77 to fold up. Interesting. I wanted an excuse to fly the BAE. That is probably the perfect plane for him. One hour fifty. Oh, okay, really? I guess noise quite big. Let's see. Wow. Yeah, I forgot how huge Norway was. Like from that is a way is it? Is this Copenhagen? Wait, well, I know Norway somewhere over here. Maybe. And I'm about to embarrass myself. Oh, that is. Is it? Someone here to somewhere here. Either way, like from here to here is is longer than from Katowice from the flight we're doing now. Wow. Okay, yeah. So definitely next flight we're going to do Oslo to Tromso. That sounds like a really fun one. Or we could try and go like long haul. You go. There's a new um. There's a new Lansmoy airport come out, which I haven't flown into it yet. I've messed around a little bit, but I haven't actually flown Lansmoy to yet. So we could. Do a long haul flight from Lanzarote to Tromso. It probably isn't a practical flight to have in real life, but yeah, it sounds like a fun one to do. I wonder what the flight time for that would be. Let's see. Oh. Well, I doubt that's. Yeah, that's a connected flight. To Oslo. That's a connected flight as well, so we don't. Yeah, that's still we've stopped. Okay, there's no reason. I reckon it, that's a solid like six. Six? No. I know it's about four from Lanzarote to Stansted. That's about twice, it might be about six hours at least that'll be. Lanzarote to Tromso. Or Tromso to Lanzarote. Yeah, about six, seven hours. It'd be a fun one. Maybe that'll be starting in the morning, do like an all day stream. It could be fun. I mean, I'm not working at the moment, so now's the time to do it. I start work next week. So, I'll make the most of the time. Fly some planes. For a very long time. Yeah, I'd love to fly around the world. Or maybe we just stick with Oslo to Tromso. Because I, c I don't know if I'd... Like, I, w I wouldn't mind sticking it on autopilot and just leaving it for eight hours. But then on one hand, what's the point in that? And two, I'll be on Vatsim, so I need to be online talking to ATC. And if I'm streaming as well, no one's going to want to watch that unless I can... Unless, I'm, unless I can, like, stay engaging. But we'll have to see. I'm looking at um, the thing on my stream. We're about halfway through the fly now. Look at the top there. That overlay is so cool. I, I love that. Like it says, I. Like, I'm surprised it's so easy to set up as well. I just downloaded this program. Like the background of the overlay, I made myself on Photoshop. So then most of them just look really bad on there. Like there were strange colours and strange shapes, and I went for that one. I love a bit of grey and orange. So that's what we did. But yeah, it looks really nice. So I found the altitude can move a bit off sometimes. As you see, like the plane says 38,000 exactly, that says 38,073. Yeah. Interesting. I wonder if you can see the, like, the Aurora's on flight simulator. You can actually see it on the flight here. That is sick. Oh wait. <laughs> this is what it would look like if introduced. Oh that's a shame. They aren't actually included. That's in P3D. 
There's got to be a mod or something that adds it. Right, if there's not already. That's so weird because it's so detailed most of the time as far as weather is concerned. Like literally, even like um, like lunar eclipses and things. Well, like this moon isn't just like that because it's like that. Like that is exactly what a moon would look like right now. So I do find it strange I don't have like the other moons. That's it. That's a shame. Like that would have looked so nice. Start ETA, um, 1118. Wow, still got like 40 hours left in the flight. 40 hours? I'd hope not. Um, 40 minutes. <laughs> I find that gift my friend a bit funny. Flights and players explain why sitting and watching the autopilot. Flying for about 9 hours is fun. It's, it's fun, isn't it? I should stream more. It's like, I always find it difficult, especially on like longer flights, to like find things to talk about. So, um, yeah. I don't know. I should just stick with it. So, I, I, I enjoy streaming more. Because sometimes, like, I'll, I'll get like existential like halfway through a long flight. Like, two hours into a flight, I'll be like, there's still two hours left. Like, why am I doing this? I could be doing something productive. Like, at least streaming gives it some sort of sense of purpose. <laughs> Um, I don't know. I should stream more, I think. I could be good. I did a stream the other day. It was nine hours. Obviously, I only did like an hour at the beginning, an hour at the end. Because um, I'm not staying up for eight hours, especially overnight. I was planning to, but it's what it is. But it happened all night. I think I was. Oh, there's a plane down there. Wait, what? Why is it gone? Did he just switch his... Wait. Why did he disappear? There he is. I wonder who he is. Let's see where he's going. Let's see where he's off to. Oh, did I close the map? I forget, you probably can't see him. He's probably off the screen. So, let's see. Good from that angle. I can't see him. There he is. You can see him. He's there. Um, I was talking about something, but I forgot what. That's cool, I guess. It probably wasn't interesting, I'll tell you that much. Um, wow, we are the only buzz plane. Which should make sense, I suppose. It's not very popular. He is going from Amsterdam to Vienna. Okay, cool. It's a nice little flight, I suppose. been able for 18 minutes now. That's only 18 minutes from Amsterdam to where he is. Wow. Okay, cool. Let's go. There we are. Look at us. Um, yeah. We're over halfway there now. Which is good. Um, arrival time is still 11.18 So I've got, uh, yeah, still about 40 minutes 40 minutes, it's like half an hour 
this side. It's weird, some people are saying. I just. Oh, so that's like a sort of predicted they're gonna. I don't know. I would watch the video, but I don't want to watch the video on screen. That's just a little bit. Okay. They've got a wallet though, right? Oh, well, that's him. Crack off the video. Yeah. It's a shame I'd really love to see them. Yeah, Buzz is owned by Ryanair. It's um, it's like a sort of Polish division, as far as I'm aware. It used to be called Ryanair Sun, but then they changed it to Buzz Air. But the um, the call sign is still. I think it's like Sun. Oh no, I can't I can't even remember it. But yeah, that's the reason. Like, I didn't know this airline even existed. So, so when I went to Poland, like I booked through Ryanair, and everything. Like it was a Ryanair flight number call sign. But then I went outside to get on the plane. A big B on it, and I don't know why that was so funny. To me. <laughs> yeah, so it is owned by Ryanair. Yeah, so I think it only operates out of Poland, to be honest. I'm, I can check that, but I think only in Poland. I have a picture actually. I wonder what the uh, registration the one I flew was. Let me check. I would check my PC, but I don't want you to. Do it. No offence guys, but I don't want you going through my pictures, so that's my point. Yeah, so the plane I was on was SPRZB. Wait, no way. RZC. Oh, I... Wait, I, I thought this was the same plane for a minute. I was like, no way. What a coincidence that would be. But no, this is RZC. I, I was on RZB. So this is the plane after the plane I was on. That's a cool thought though, eh? That's so cool. Actually, yeah, the plane I was on as well didn't have the split this one does. So yeah. I'm not going to have a look at the picture. Oh, also on the plane. Oh, that is accurate. Yes, it didn't have the split wing though. I don't think it did. I can't even see it. No, I didn't. I would switch the winglet type over. Like now, but. I hope it doesn't. Let's do it. I hope it doesn't crash anything or anything like that. I can't see it would, but. Let's see. Fingers crossed it don't. Otherwise, I might cry. People did you set up aircraft equipment? Obviously, Collins. Like the amount of detail you can go in like on this add-on is, is crazy. So I just cannot wait for the 800 to come out. I, as I said, I think it's going to be a little while, but it's going to be good. Stand my instruments. Let's set this to it. Uh, I think that's the one. So yeah, cause the new like tech track I have only supports. What other options are there? We have that only. And add on. Okay. So yeah, I think this is what we need. So the detail on this add-on is insane. You can't really see it now, but more so at, like at the stand. You could really see the reflection of like just the grime of things on on the surfaces. Like as it just looks so realistic. But yeah, that's it. This is old style. What's the new car style? Oh, that's horrible. Parking rates change? I don't like that, I'm gonna be real. I didn't even know it was a thing, like, I don't think I've ever seen that. Yeah, we have the other stuff. They're all cut out. Oh, yeah, winglets, that's what we're doing. Cabin layout 2 plus, plus eyebrow windows. No way there's eyebrow windows here. Oh, that's sick. So we can actually see out of the out of the top. I mean, that's not realistic, like 
on this particular plane, but that is so cool. I wonder what that looks like from the outside. Wow, yeah. That's awesome. I love that. I will turn that off though. Just like that. Um, I will turn that off because it's just not realistic. Wi Fi antenna, no. Headrest will turn off. Oh, interesting, that's not there. Why do we change the, the winglet types? I can't see it. Yes, yes. Cyan, dual battery package. Please engage. Got the carbon brakes, obviously. Got the external light package, that's always cool. Oh, it's interesting, it's just not here. What's that in space? Oh. I haven't actually like, dug through this, it's probably not very fun to watch. Oh. There we go. No, that's cool. Well, I can't find how to change the window type. Maybe it's something like you can only do it on the ground, which would make sense, I suppose. Unless I'm the aircraft. That's where we just was, isn't it? Set up options. Simulation. Sync camps in here. Realistic AP management engagement. Show thrust level position. What does that do? Okay, now let's just leave that. I don't want to end up messing something up. Call out SP like 80 knots. Let's turn 80 knots on. I always say that. was at top of the set, that's sick. So if I was doing a long flight, like, and I was in bed, I could make it pause. And that's good, I like that. Okay. Hide, hide the seats. Okay, so I, I can't... I can't see how to change the window types. Oh well, it's not the end of the world. This one. What time are we expecting to get? Is it under land? No, it's not. It must be under legs. What progress? Two for 40 knots. Wow. That's funny, like, we literally have... We have hardly any wind in Stanford. We had, like, no wind. We had, like, one or two knots in Katowice. But over Europe, we've got 40 knots of wind. Twenty-three, twenty-six Zulu, which is twenty-six past midnight here in the UK. It's really not all that bad. Um, yeah. So, should I put some music on? That was the original plan. But then I thought maybe this ain't the right time for music or advice. I mean, it'd be better with my camera. Like if my camera's on, I'd be like proper light, you know, having a little rave in my 737, as you do. But no camera, which is kind of sad. Like you can't see me vibe. It's just silent to it, and albeit six on. What you got on? I like this one. Oh. <laughs> I'm in the club, is smelling their keys. Men are weird at the close of the PM. Just ask a pretty girl to show you her DMs. Close me at the bar, blurry to the drink. Close me at the bar, you'll be thirsty with the drink. She said, take me as I am. Or watch me as I go. Oh yeah. As promised in the title, we are now listening to some bangers. Yeah. We're not even flying to Poland anymore. Okay. We're going to 
Maybe it's a two standard this time. I might change the titles over actually. Don't want to be lying. It's more just for the VOD so it's accurate. Ah! Okay, I dropped the controller. Let's hope I didn't knock any uh, the like the flat buttons or anything like it. As I go. Such a sick song. Oh, this song's like. Brand new. Absolutely slaps. It's like traumatic new song. Oh, I lost the viewer. <laughs> they obviously don't appreciate the DMV. That's a shame. <laughs> they obviously don't appreciate the music. Fair enough to be fair, it doesn't really suit the stream. It don't really suit, does it? Oh, camera. Let's see, like, where are they? They're getting a bit of cow cover over there. Let's see, it's crazy the amount of wind now. That sucks. Though. I thought that was a. I thought that was my plane. But that was not. Oh, to alter my ego I don't need a placebo I feel that's fully activated and now I see through the keyhole I'm giving them tantric energy I've got a high libido when I'm making love on magic mushrooms I feel like a hero I've got special powers I'm eating precious flowers I'm throwing flaming fireballs at all the jealous cowards I've got special powers I'm eating precious flowers I know verbalism, I'm verbalism, I'm work to rhythm, let me in a big gun. I don't lie like journalism, I'm good at rhythm, we're rules of wisdom, I just kill him with kindness. Puff and give him a virus. I'm so sick of this violence, but I'm not living in silence. I've activated my sixth sense, it's overwhelming, it's intense. If there's negative energy in the room, I'm burning. Are real pilots allowed to listen to Mr. Traumatic on their flights or what? That is an interesting point actually. Like, um. Are pilots allowed to listen to music and like watch things in flight? Like it's interesting thoughts, especially on the sort of long flights like we're talking like eight hours plus. How are you just gonna stay awake? Because at the end of the day you are sitting there watching the UI pilot to a certain degree. Obviously you need to be monitoring things like monitoring ATC, watching news and things like that, but I I just feel so tired after a while. I don't know if it's just me but that's an interesting one. They've got to be able to listen to music, although they might not be able to hear like, like warnings and things. I don't know. I'm gonna Google that actually. We can find out together. Maybe it's a dumb question. Can pilots listen to music? Oh, okay, yes, you're yeah, able to pilots listen to music, so it's not distracting. Oh wow. So that yeah, pilots are allowed to, uh, to listen to music. That is sick. Oh, this one says nine. Yeah, interesting. Okay, so they're not allowed. I regularise that. So maybe it's more of a. Um, yeah, maybe it's more like an airline specific thing. We're turning. We're turning into. It's probably every airline has their own sort of regulation for that sort of thing, which makes sense. It's interesting. Though, like, how do they sort of stay like away? Yeah. Um, uniform popping off in a 
shame we don't have many people speak on uniform. But it's just nice to have a bit of ATC chat in the background. But there's no one talking. Obviously the chat's popping off, but... I suppose yeah. Oh wow, we're actually getting the UK Unicom at the moment, so they're getting with, with Glyce. Let me zoom out a bit, see if we can... Roughly how far away we are. Oh wow, so um, we're about 60 miles away from our top of the tent at the moment. Which is when it really kicks off. Like, we've gone from like chilling out, and it gets like quite difficult. At least for me, maybe not for everyone else, but as you could probably tell through the whole stream, I'm a bit slow. So, yeah. It's gonna be a bit. a bit like chaotic as we come in for our approach, but. I'm going to absolutely butter this land in. Absolutely grease it. Like, you don't even know what's about to happen. I'm going to replay. I've got a fight recorder and everything. I'm going to record it. Let's see. Smoothest land ever recorded in the 77. I'm, I'm telling you, it's going to be great. I mean, I have just jinxed it by saying that. But at least now I have an excuse if it goes bad. <laughs> Yeah, we'll see. I wonder why I'm leveled like, I'm not sure how my mic is. I'm not going really to check, so I'm going to say something and quickly switch over to my laptop. Hello, 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 test, check, one, two, three, go! I really care that much about it, but that's what it is. Isn't it? Oh, it's a good song. everyone's days. You know, a little bit of a user interaction. Just drop it in chat. How, how's the day going guys? Everyone? <laughs> My day's going pretty good. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm not really cut out to be a streamer, am I? It's all good. It's all good. I try to get rid of it, but I can't, and I don't know what's causing it. Like, it's so strange. Someone's coming into Frankfurt, he's um, going to direct DF426. Cool, I guess. Why would you put that in uniform? Who wants to hear that? Thank you. 
miles. You see it's approaching pretty quick. Why are we so climbing? Let's go spend We should have reached up to point like A. It's not quite a stranger. But it's sort of sitting at 38,000 feet. It's really nice having you here. It's great. I'll, um, if you want to catch a land and I'll upload it separately on my channel. It's going to be so smooth. Just, just, it's really nice having you here. I look, I look forward to seeing you again. It's going to be fine to Oslo next. So you'll be there to see that.
that was mental. Okay, should we try again? Let's try one first. Then let's try one more and find it off. That's crazy. Enemies 
let's just let us do its thing. And yeah, we'll see. This is why like um the AP to an X has such a good EFB. Like and this doesn't have any but the EFB that lets you calculate your top of the same. So like it breaks you current LG comes to be like how long you've got and it tells you like when you can start top of the same at a certain level. I have three degrees in the sky. But yeah, it's kind of a
30 claps and there we go. Nice. We might bring our speed down a bit as well, is there a way to see the target speed?
yeah, we're not making it. Why was it? Why didn't it descend? I want to do. Because I really don't want to do the go. Let's just let's just see what how this works for us. Tell it we're going around. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, Mr. Pro. So that that's that actually. Way this is going, I can't promise anything. <laughs> so. Yes, yeah, so I'll try my best not to. I will try. Well, I think we're quite far away from any big buildings at the moment, so we're all good. If you were landing in Heathrow, that'd be a different story, but we're not. So we're all right, we're all good. Let's just vector ourselves on the guy around because it doesn't seem to want to do it for us. It doesn't want to do anything by the looks of it. I said that's a head select, I guess. Let's find our bank and go down a bit. Oh, you know what? I've put the 10 seatbelt signs on, people. I'm landing like to on. Good. Um. Well, I think that's what we need to do. We need to turn these to continuous. Let's do a 10. <laughs> You're just going to teleport across your landing real quick. Be right back, guys. This is Ryanair 7923. Requesting regardless approach into the Twin Tower? No, I didn't say that. That was well inappropriate. That was well inappropriate, I'd never say that. Not on a stream. Who is Ye Old T guy? Do I know you? Or are you just, just another viewer? I can't tell.
cannot believe I have to have missed a pro, it just sucks. Oh well. We live and we learn. Honestly though, like, it just did not descend on itself. Like, and it was too late when I realised. Maybe we could descend it a bit quicker, but how was I meant to know? It was supposed to descend on its own. I know you. I'm scared. I'm scared. I know you. I... Who is this guy? I'm gonna say because he was there and then he... Then he left, then he came back. But I, I don't think a regular like, normal viewer would just do that. Well, I take you in the Discord, because that's how you got the link. There's no information about your profile, okay, that's nice. I'm trying to stalk you. <laughs> Sorry, I'll stop, it's a bit weird. <laughs> Don't this stream's actually been on the right so far. Like, it's getting a bit boring now, to run out of things to talk about. Yeah, big up by the web development. You, can you do me a favour and not say that on my stream then, please? Because there's ways that that can be used to get information. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm sounding like I care. Bro, like, I'm kind of lonely. If you want to just shut up at my door, like, I'm not going to stop you at the end of the day. Any, like, viewers out there? Like, I'm here getting pressed about you, like, bro, if you want to come over, like, I'm just not going to stop you. I'm going to come in for a cup of tea or something. We can maybe fly a plane together. Talk to myself earlier. No, I didn't. Um, I was, well, I could explain it. If I explained it, then I would dox myself. But just know I didn't dox myself, because it's also an aviation term. I do like the fact though you're actually paying attention to the stream. That's sick. No, no, don't worry about it. I can't care. You're Callum, no way. You're real? <gasps> oh my days. I thought you were just a myth all along. You're real. What was I chatting about earlier? Oh yeah. Like, it's been pretty good. Like, obviously, it's not the most entertaining now because it's late and run out. As I said, like earlier, like I was chatting the whole time. It's sick. Chat was proper active for some reason. Like that was, that was sick. Like that one, like 10, 15 minute period where chat was really active. That was sick. Anyway, the only human interaction you have all month. In Twitch chat. It's a bit sad actually. Actually, no, I spoke to ATC the other day. Air traffic controller's got a count, isn't it? Okay. That's such a shame. I was, I was getting ready to end it, but obviously that's not right. Where's the airport? Yeah, it should be just like over here. Oh, this bit here. Okay, that's cool. How fluffy the seats are as well. It's my favourite part about this plane. It's a fluffy seats. It's sick. I did turn the music off so I could focus. But at the same time, I think the music really adds something to it. I hate the fact that the edge opens up. Wait, did I close eyes? What did I hate? Oh yeah, I hate the fact Edge on old tab has every tab separately. Like, it's so annoying. Do you want to listen to this song again? It's like the third time. No, we don't. Let's get it. It's a pretty good one. I quite like this one. I'm going to stop recording because 
I don't want to record that whole go around. I keep on meaning to record the whole flight. Like, so we get a takeoff and everything, but I just keep on every time I just forget. Like, I forget every time. But it's fine. Also, how bad is playing copyrighted music? Like, really see what's going to happen. Um, I don't know, to be honest. I I was using Opera, but Opera's turned shit. Chrome is just not worth touching in the temp of anymore. And it's just what I use. I don't really use the browser all that much. Like, most of the work and stuff I do is on, on my Mac. Like, I only use it for playing games, so I just stick of Edge. Edge is pretty good as well. Like, it's got way better. Like, it's still sort of that stigma from when Windows first came out. Windows 10, I mean. But it's got alright. Like, it comes with an ad blocker included and things like that, like I said. I'm not saying it's the best browser, but it's not bad. Like, it does what it needs to do, and it doesn't, it's not, there's no bad things about it. That's a very long way of saying that's kind of almost a brilliant browser. I'm gonna be real. <laughs> like, I'm telling my main came around to 10, so we should be able to set ahead in my way. True, I actually think I removed in an Explorer from, from uh, Windows 11. Yeah, they did. It doesn't exist anymore. The Internet Explorer is dead. Sorry to say. Otherwise, yeah, that would be my go-to browser of choice, naturally. Well, yeah. Let's set our attitude to 4,000 feet on RAM. So that means not some money in it. Surgeons actually listen to music when I do surgery, like to help with focus. Like that's sick. Imagine listening to like really heavy like drum and bass, like working on someone's heart. Oh what about that one surgeon who doesn't have Spotify premium? So it's like getting added with it like doing surgery. I, I don't know what I was talking like what the point of bringing that up was, but you're welcome. Let's just set out two thousand. I don't know if we descended fast enough. <laughs> oh, we do seem quite low to be fair. Oh shit, I've got a text off the standard. Okay. Transition was 6000, so that's cool. I think, obviously, we're not turning as fast as we probably should be. Let's set our course to 221 as well, because I'm pretty sure that's the wrong way heading. on the old scroller. Oh yeah. um, we're actually a bit low now, you know, let's see that back up to uh, We should be able to intercept the ILS in a minute. What's the beeping at? Does it beep when we're nearly at our altitude? Is that what the beep is? It always seems to be the weird size. Oh, well, we didn't have the fuel to do a go around. Why is it, mate? What are you hitting the throttles for? Oh, I guess to like hold altitude. We want to be slow. Shut up, please. Days, mate. Shut your bloody mouth. Alright, we've got ILS frequencies tuned in, 111.5, both sides, okay. Cool. So once we level out, our, our landing system is on. Our VOR localizer. Can we click that yet? Should be able to, yeah, okay. Why is it accelerating for... We should be able to intercept the overlies now, I don't know why it's not working. Is L9 
kind of have to be selected first, maybe? No, it literally just ain't working. Oh, it may. We might just have to do an all manual approach, which I really don't want to do, to be honest with you. Retard. Yeah, I know I need to slow down. Oh shit, I've got that flat. I was completely dead. Okay, let's give us a bit of speed brakes as well, it's all I need them. Slow down pretty urgently. We also need to lose altitude quick. Why ain't the localizer on? Oh, actually, why isn't the localizer on? Can I turn this off? Let me on. What? What? Approach. Okay, we're on approach. Hopefully. No longer on. Let's just push it to the side of it. That's it. That's it. Approach. Mate, what's happening? Approach. Wait, is it what? I can't even run. What the hell? Okay, so we're on the glide slope, but it's not aligned. Relatively decent man, but if I didn't. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Fuck. 
fuck this plane? What is going on? Turn, mate. The auto brakes aren't even on. What the fuck is up with this plane? Why wouldn't approach mode work? Genuinely, I feel sick. I just spent, what, like three hours in the air for that to happen. Can you shut the fuck up, please? Thanks. I cannot believe it. I mean, at least it let me land and didn't crash at our time. Let's, let's shut down. That's, oh, mate, that's just so annoying. Like, genuinely. Power flaps up, speed brakes, uh, speed brake. Oh, four at idle, um, what else do we need to do? Shut down. Let's wait for our APU to start, then we'll shut engines down. It's a fucking game, I can't. Like, why did it not. Like, it literally just drifted away from the fucking. And there was no wind as well, so I can't even say it was wind doing that. We should have gone around definitely, but then once we landed it just... Oh, um, that was just because I disconnected to the autopilot, because the autopilot was, wasn't working for some reason. So I, it, when you disconnect it, it does that, so you know it's disconnected. But yeah, that sucked. Je I, I actually feel sick after that. Like that that flight just went so smooth the whole way. Then that was that was all the plane. Like that was none of it was my doing near the end. Because I, I, I put too much trust in the in the autopilot. And in the end that like we were way off of the um like we were way off of the ILS. So then I had to like, yeah, the first time, the first approach we tried to make, it didn't descend at all. Like I even started it off, and then it just like it was it was descending, but nowhere near fast enough for some reason. Okay, we got our APU turned on. Um, let's turn on APU bleed. Turn these off. Turn this these off. This to open. Let's um engines shut down. What was I saying? Yeah, that first time like it just didn't do its thing like it should have done. Then the second approach, well you just saw it, like it just didn't. Whatever. Maybe, uh, it probably is my fault to be honest, this is a really good add-on, but still like it just makes me feel a bit sick like, after so long. But, but let's, uh, let's do our shutdown procedures. Um, See, let's turn this fuel pump off as well. Our let's turn our hydraulic pumps off. Switch these off. Definitely turn these off now. These are already off. Taxi lights off. Logo on. It's steady only. Turn logo light off. Okay, I think we're good. Then let's switch off the APU. The oh yeah, emergency exit lights come on. Let's just remember where that is. Turn these off. And then let's put our flashlight on. Let's turn our battery off too. Okay. There we are, fully shut down. Let's switch our T cast actually like to standby. And yeah, there we are, I think that's it. Switch this to off too. So there we are. A not too graceful approach, but all in all a pretty good flight from Katowice to Stansted. 
in the bars 2, 9 or 2, 3. It's such a shame, because it was such a good flight, I genuinely I thought I was going to absolutely grease that landing, but I didn't. Such a shame. But, it's what it is. Next time will be better, I suppose. I haven't done that many landings in this plane, to be honest, so... I'll watch some videos on it, see if I did anything wrong. Because I have been flying Airbuses for a while, like, recently. I've been doing more long-haul flights, but... Run the car over, shall I? I kind of can't, because I turn the plane off, but I can, I can cheat it on top of the car. Oh yeah, see? Wh where the hell did the car go? The car's gone. Should we watch that landing see what it looked like? Let's watch the landing. Replay. There we are. Let's just watch that complete disgrace of the landing all my days. Okay, let's, let's see. Oh yeah, I forgot the engines aren't. We make it daytime actually. We can't. Oh. oh no. That first bounce. If I didn't pull up there, because I sort of panicked. If I didn't pull up there, it would have been alright. I think. I don't know. I need to remember as well, we didn't have hardly any fuel, so we were really light. Well, it looks like a whole new game, eh? Bloody hell. Okay, let's see what that looks like. <laughs> it wasn't very stable either, was it? And them noises he leave a lot to be desired as well. <laughs> yeah, um... It's peaceful though, isn't it? Obviously the engines aren't, because the replay only moves the plane. Like it doesn't do anything else. So because we turn the engines off, the engines won't be running. But okay, that's perfect actually. If I would have just stayed true and didn't touch the flight controls, it Oh man, it would have genuinely I would have fucking greased it if I just did you see like I pulled up at that point. That's like at where is it? See it's like look. At this point here, look look how like s we're just coming down perfectly, the nose was up but I pulled up. At that moment now I pulled up and I shouldn't have done. I think I was trying to flare or something. Because of everything what happened, like I sort of panicked. And then that happened. And then this happened. <laughs> oh no. Watching that replay it, it kinda was my fault. But I got kinda flustered because I the approach was so bad and that wasn't my fault, the approach. But yeah. Look at this though, look how quick this like <laughs> quick it was to the stand. In fact, there's a plane there, mate. Careful. Um. <laughs> okay, yeah. That's made me sort of think maybe it was my fault. But yeah, it was fun. That was fun, I suppose. Up until that last, that last little moment there. Okay, let me stop replay. Then, just for fun, let's just drop this plane from space, because why not? It's funny, innit? Watch this, this is, this is funny. Wait, this is how you're meant to fly a plane? Next up, should I do 9-11 now? Like, you know what? Since, since you're here, since you're here, I'll go to London, and we'll do a little, a little fun. Where's the map? Where's London on this map? Since you, you know, since you're a real one, you're stuck here for a while, We'll, we'll go over to London. If I can... Whoa, what on earth? Where even is London? There's... Golf, Golf, Romeo. Um, where is London? Here, I guess. Is that the River Thames? Maybe? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. We're going to London, everybody. We're going on a little trip. So I just need to sort of go forwards. Then this way. You're about to see. Exactly. I hate the fact now, though, I've got um five viewers, so there's people here who...
probably just a little tomfoolery, exactly. Oh shit, I'm on Vatsim. Okay, I need to disconnect from this. I literally would have got insta banned if I did that. Let's disconnect. <laughs> I forgot about that. Okay. <laughs> that would have been embarrassing, eh? Just a little bit of tomfoolery. You know how it goes. Is this the River Thames? It is. Okay, let's follow it. Let's follow the River Thames. Wait, no, that's the wrong bit of the River Thames. Oh my god. Since when were there two River Thameses? What? Wait, this is Heathrow. How did I end up here? Okay, I think. If I carry on going straight, yeah. Oh my god, I can see the shard. Look. What do you reckon our target is? The shard? Is the shard good? Um, we'll be going too fast so the ground hasn't actually rendered in yet. Yeah, only the... <laughs> okay, there, that looks alright. Yeah, look, it's all loaded in now. I think maybe the shard should be our target. Or the gherkin, that's a really ugly building, eh? I think fuck the, fuck the shard, you know. Who, who likes the shard? Am I right, boys? Big Ben! Oh, shit, mate. Yeah, yeah, good point. Where's Big Ben at? Here it is. Biggie Ben. In this the Queen's house or something? Look. Let's get a close look at it, yeah? Where's where's Tower Bridge? We need to, like, fly over that as well. Or under it. What way is Tower Bridge? Oops. Do you know how to London? There we are, right. I think, bear in mind our engines aren't on, which actually might be a bit of a problem. Whoa, we're going so quick, how? Did we, did we just miss? <laughs> should, I, should I try again if the plane turned on this time? Uh, because for some reason the plane like generated loads of speed. I might because obviously it generates lift naturally, otherwise it wouldn't be a plane. Alright, you know, shut up, you know. I'm good at actual flying. Um Let's see. Can you stop beeping at me please, Let's go. Uh, is there an approach? There we are, approach. Let's execute this. So now this should just start the plane for us automatically. Yeah, look at that. we now? There's the shard. Where's Big Ben at? Oh, here's Tower Bridge. Should we try that? Do you reckon I could fly through Tower Bridge? Right, shut up about the landing. <laughs> the landing weren't my fault. Yo, do you reckon I could actually fly through it? Alright, that's which we're giving it a go, guys. <laughs> we're trying to go through. Oh, 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 it's too quick, too quick, too quick. Ah, we did it! I did it! Everybody! Who's bad at flying now? Let's put our flaps up. Screw flaps. Okay, let's, let's try again. Let's try again. I don't think... Shut up about bank angle! What are you on about, mate? Pilot, I think I know exactly what bank angle I should be at, and that bank angle is 90 degrees, okay? Here's the Here's the Here's the oh, airspeed speed is pretty low, actually, it's gives some for us. Then, then, let's turn it on. Bank angle, bank angle. Let's bank go for part two, yeah? Right? Shall, shall I recreate the, uh, the Hudson River? I think, the, I think the River Thames is too, like, small. We can try. Terrain, terrain, pull up. Terrain, terrain, pull up. And there's so many bridges, but we can keep going. Terrain, pull up. Terrain, terrain, pull up. Terrain, terrain, pull up. Terrain, terrain. Pull up. Terrain, terrain, pull up. Let's give us some flaps, actually. I think we need to. Too low, terrain. 
Shall I record it? Too low terrain. Forward, terrain. Forward. terrain. Yes. Pull up. Too low terrain. Too low terrain. Should right, crash into Big Ben or should we terrain. land on the river? Which one? Too low terrain. Nah, you know, what? land on the river. Bank angle. Too low. Bank angle. Laps. Too low. Flaps. Here's B. Oh. Here's B. Oh. 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 Too low. Flaps. Pull up. Too low. Flaps. Pull up. Too low. Flaps. Pull up. Crash into a boat, but it's all good. But we landed. Somehow that was smoother than my original landing. Should we watch that back? Look at this bank angle on my face. Look at this. This is how a real pilot flies. Look. Narrowly avoided big bank. <laughs> right to the boat. I can only a few casualties. I especially love the, uh, I love how I do one bad landing and I turn into a terrorist. That's cool. That's cool, I guess. How long was I streaming for? Fucking four hours. What? The passengers right now. Base stream. Yeah, base stream. But that was fun. Actually, I want to try, like, I've never flown, um, Oh, what plane is it? The, the mili they come out with a new military plane, I ain't flown it before. I think maybe now, while well, I'm in my terrorism phase, is maybe a good time to fly it. The Boeing F-18 Super Hornet. It's a sick plane. Where should we fly this, guys? <laughs> Can I fly upside down over London? <laughs> in a 747? <laughs> yeah, good question. I think if you haven't thought that question, then there's probably something wrong with you. Okay, where should we fly, guys? Give me... Go in chat. First first one I see, we're going to. Anywhere in the world. Oh, oh shit, I forgot. You know like, why London looks so shit? Toronto? What a dead place. But okay, I did say first person. Let's go to Toronto. First, I need to do this. Because I forgot, I wondered why um, London looks so weird, because I didn't download London. Oh. Don't want that yet. Download. Because the world updates make it like actually look physically real, like every single building is... is <laughs> the World Trade, Trade Centre Memorial. I tell you what, we go to Toronto first, and then that's, that's a solid... That's a solid second, I think. Is this even Toronto? Yeah, it is. Okay. <laughs> the World Trade Center and more. Um, let's go to the city center. Why is the city center in the sea? 
As I said, I've never flown this plane before, so don't judge me, yeah? I've got a feeling it's going to be a fun one, though. I think it's time for some bangers again. I like this song. Let's skip forward to the low. Just write some frog. I go. Yes, I am. Watch me as I go. Melodies of love all selling the dream. Everyone in the club is smelling their keys. Men are weird at the close of the PM. Just ask a pretty girl to show you her DMs. Why is it taking so long? I don't really take this long. Watch me as I go. You're messing with my mind and my feelings in your eyes. It's a blessing in disguise, but it's really well disguised. Regret this in the morning. Shots of the ride, but that's future me. I'm glad I'm not that guy. Take me as I am, or watch me as I go. Okay, that's enough. That's enough fun for one stream. Not having it. Serious business, mate. We're gonna um, cause a tragedy in Toronto. Just for the meme. Just for the vine, guys. And it's nothing personal, I promise. Nothing personal. Let's listen to this one. Not too far, actually. We'd probably be able to get there in like 30 seconds, like if quick travelling. It's fine. Oh, this was a banger. Take a listen to this, guys. This is someone gonna listen to when we terrorize innocent victims. Now, I've got to be honest, my terrorist arc was an unexpected one. Say that. Oh, Toronto looks sick, you know. Whoa! Turn so quick. Mm. Snapped on base, that's what I'm saying. This one I can fly up. Look how quick it turns. <laughs> that's so sick. We fly from the outside. Camera.
I turn them on? I had a comfortable that was before I did to be like bouncing the tire to Oh, it's good to see it. Like, I think it's... Yeah, it's fun. It's like, like, I don't know, it's, like, it's actually like more than half of it. Like, everything here is like, accurate. But I don't like the like, part really. It's one of those weird things about the pressure. Oh, what? Did the game just crash? Okay. Okay. Yeah. I mean, they're the worst times to crash, I guess. They were way worse times for the crash. I got special powers. Like it only came out a few weeks ago. I got special powers. I got special powers. Wow. From eating precious flowers. 
I got special powers From using precious flowers I use DMT to alter my ego I don't need a placebo My third eye's fully activated And now I see through the keyhole I'm giving them tantric energy I've got a high libido When I'm making love on magic mushrooms I feel like a hero I've got special powers From eating precious flowers I'm throwing flaming fireballs At all the jealous cowards I've got special powers From eating precious flowers I know herbalism, I'm herbalism, I'm work to rhythm, then burn a big un. I don't lie like journalism, I murder rhythm with words of wisdom. I just kill him with kindness, cough and give him a virus. I'm so sick of this violence, but I'm not living in silence. I've activated my sixth sense, it's overwhelming, it's intense. If there's negative energy in the room, I'm. That's it. No more planes, no more terrorism, no more stream. Sorry, guys. I'll see you all tomorrow, do another stream, I guess because I'm not working and I have nothing better to do with my time than to fly a pretend aeroplane. So, it's been a pleasure guys. Jack Weller, Boomer Reflexes. I'm going out. Goodbye. Oh wait. I forgot I had a stream on here, not on my laptop. Okay. Yeah again. Au revoir amigo.